Let me introduce how to create a blog with Ocean WP free theme. The screen you are seeing is the official demo theme of Ocean WP. Let's get started. Go to the Install Demos menu in the Theme panel. Press the Blog tab, it shows four demo themes. In my case, the Maria theme is not imported properly. So, I am going to review the other three themes. Let me show you how to import the Blogger theme, and how to build your own blog website after import. Let's browse the official demo website. The menu style is a full screen style. Front page shows the archive posts. The single post has a sidebar on the right. To delete previously imported data, I will reset WordPress with a database reset plugin. Reset operation will be delete all WordPress data except administrator account. Please do not follow this operation when it's a running website. This is only for those who want to reset the website. Those who have never imported a demo website, do not need to follow as well. I use the WordPress reset plugin that I've introduced before. Install the WP database reset. It says to update the plugin. Click the link to install it. It shows what changes. Type reset and click on the reset site button. Click Blogger Demo. Press Go to the Next Step link. With all checked, click Install this demo. Import has been successfully completed. Let's check the imported website. Compared to the demo website, the notable difference are the header style, and front page. The single post is no different from the demo website. Let's change the menu style. I explained how to change menu style in detail in the architect theme review video. Go to header options in the themes panel. Change the header style to full style. Check it on the front end after publishing. It has been changed to a full screen style menu like a demo. Let me replace the site title with the logo. Scroll down and press Select Logo button. In both places, logos are registered. Moves to the upper level. Press the logo. In both places, upload logos. After publishing, check on the front end website. Go to the page menu and press Edit Home Page. It says, you are currently editing the page that shows your latest posts. Let me change the front page settings to make it look like a demo website. Let me create a page with the name All Posts. I will replace current front page to this page. Go to Reading under Settings menu. Change your home page to Home.
Posts page to all posts. Both home and all posts show a list of posts, but they will have a different style. Save and check it on the website. Now the front page only shows the sidebar. Go to the menu under Appearance and register the All Post page to the menu. Check the All Posts page. The list of posts that were initially shown on the home page is now showing on this page. Go to Front Page Edit. Change the content layout to full width. Go to the plugin menu and install at Activate Premium Add ons for Elementor. Press Edit with Elementor link under Front Page. Scroll down and find the Premium Add on section. Add a premium blog. In the demo site, it is four columns. Let's change the number of column to four columns. The post per page is where we set how many posts will be displayed. Let me set it to 50. Adjust the number according to the capacity of your web server. Otherwise, the page can take a lot of time to load. Let me change the layout to masonry. Let's check it after updating. Masonry style blocks automatically reassemble when screen size changes. The advantage is that the style does not break even if the height of each grid is different. In case of archive posts, there are some thumbnail images and some don't, so every post height will be different. In this case, the masonry is a great option. There is a padding on the left and right of the section, so the alignment is a bit uneven. Click the middle icon of the section. Change the content width to full width. Save and check it on the front-end website. 